In other news, Senator Juan Ponce Enriles, former Chief of Staff Attorney Gigi Reyes, has been transferred to the Philippine Heart Center without the Sandigan Bayan's approval. The BJMP explained that the emergency transfer was based on the interagency referred request and clinical abstract issued by the Taguig Hospital Chief and by attending physician Dr. Anthony Lontok. More on that from AC Nichols. She's reporting from the Sandigan Bayan. Hi, AC. My Senator Juan Ponce Enriles, former Chief of Staff Attorney Gigi Reyes, filed a supplemental motion asking the Sandigan Bayan to agree to her transfer to a tertiary hospital. Reyes is a co-accused in plunder and graft cases being heard before the anti-graft court's third division over the alleged funneling of Enrile's pork barrel to fake non-government organizations. She was ordered detained at the female dormitory of the Taguig City Jail in Camp Bagong Diwa last Wednesday night but was rushed to the Taguig Pateros District Hospital hours later for severe panic attacks. From the Taguig Pateros District Hospital, Reyes was transferred to the Philippine Heart Center last Friday night. That day, Reyes had already filed a motion before the court asking it to allow her transfer to a tertiary hospital. In a supplemental motion filed before the court this morning, Reyes's camp explained she had to be transferred to a tertiary hospital last Friday as she might suffer from an acute coronary event such as a heart attack or a stroke. The attending physician, Dr. Anthony Lontok, said Reyes continued to have difficulty breathing despite taking medication. Considering the lack of facilities at the Taguig Pateros Hospital, Dr. Lontok authorized Reyes' emergency transfer to the Philippine Heart Center. A medical certificate signed by Lontok was attached to Reyes' motion, and it says the accused complained of headaches and drowsiness on Friday afternoon, though there were no significant changes in her ECG or electrocardiogram. Reyes was confined at the Philippine Heart Center's intensive care unit. She wants the court to formalize her continued confinement at the PHC until her medical condition improves. Reyes is also asking the court to reconsider its decision denying her request to be detained at the Philippine National Police Custodial Center instead of a regular jail, considering that a tertiary hospital, namely the PNP General Hospital, is nearby. The Bureau of Jail Management and Penology this morning has also submitted a report to the court explaining the circumstances surrounding Reyes's transfer. The court has subpoenaed Reyes's attending physician at Taguig Pateros District Hospital, the hospital's medical director, as well as the medical director or a representative from the Philippine Heart Center. Also ordered to appear before the court are the warden of the Taguig City Jail, its roving doctor, and a repre representative from its legal affairs office. The Sandigan Bayan 3rd Division will take up Reyes' motions in a hearing tomorrow afternoon. May? Thanks, AC. AC Nichols there reporting live from the Sandigan Bayan.